This is a rare and exciting occurrence. Austin Mayor Kirk Watson is encouraging everyone to take advantage of their front row seat to Monday's total solar eclipse. For many Texans, it will be a once in a lifetime experience. There will not be another total eclipse visible from this area until the year 2343, which is over 300 years from now. The great views from Central Texas and the Hill Country are helping to bring more than a million visitors to the state. Hotel occupancy is currently averaging around 77% from Saturday through Monday night in the downtown area. And over the same period, uh, hotel rates are up by 48% over this time last year. Austin's airport is expecting to be much busier than normal and everyone flying in is arranging to drive out so they can get the best views. Our rental car operators have let us know that they are 100% fully booked for available rental cars on April 8th. Traffic from Austin to the Hill Country is expected to be clogged with people traveling to, through, and within Central Texas. Our major corridors could see gridlock, and because the Hill Country is a prime spot for viewing, they could see standstill traffic as well. More people means more cell phones, and experts are warning everyone to be prepared for interruptions in service, especially on Monday. Text messages may have more success than a call. City and county leaders are hoping Monday's weather is exactly like today's, but the forecast six days out is calling for clouds and possibly rain. We get a lot of low clouds, very thick clouds in the morning, especially in the springtime. If we have a lot of that cloudiness, then that may actually hamper some of our viewing. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.